One of the benefits of placing images into InDesign is that you can link them to an outside source. To place an image, remember that we go to File, Place, and we choose the image we'd like, click Open, and the icon of the image attaches to our cursor and allows us to position it where we want it to show and by clicking the image appears. Once you place an image that way you'll see that in the links palette your image shows as a link. In other words InDesign is looking in a specific location to include that image into the document. If I select the image and copy it by pressing Control C and then pasting it by pressing Control V, you'll see that not only does this document show up, but it shows up as a linked image in the links window. So it shows the master image and how many times it's used and on what page. The benefit to linking your images is you can change them easily by selecting the image you want to change and choosing the relink toggle button at the bottom of the window. And this will open a folder where you can select a different image and change it. Notice how the frame of the original image is still sized for the cat on the piano and the new picture fits inside. So simply by selecting the image and going to Object, Fitting, Fit Frame to Content, we now have a new image and both of them are linked. The important thing to remember about linking your images is that when you send your image filled document to the printer you'll want to make sure that the images are included with the file that you send. Ensuring that they are linked allows you to change them and also collect them when the time comes and we'll show you the collecting method in a different lesson. Another thing that will occur is if the link is broken you will see warning signs where it's linked showing you that the location of the document can't be found and you need to relink that document. So always check your links. Make sure there's no warning signs for missing or changed links. If you change the image outside of InDesign and save it, InDesign will give you a warning that that image has been changed outside of InDesign and will allow you to relink it to update the changes that you've made. Always view your links and make sure that you use them to make sure your document is prepared for the printer in the best possible way.